everyone, we're here today at Chiang Mai, a famous tourist destination in northern Thailand, a city known for its striking mountainous landscape and ancient temples. And of course, we will be covering one of the most famous local Islamic landmarks, which is the Ban Ha Mosque, located in the heart of the well-known tourist area, the Chiang Mai Night Bazaar. So join us today on a journey through the must-see destinations of Chiang Mai and the history of Ban Ha Mosque. into the history of the Ban Ha Mosque, we must first talk about Zheng Chongling, or Kun Shuang Liang Lu Giet, whose name was given by King Rama VII. Liang Lu Giet played a key role in establishing the Muslim community and mosque in Chiang Mai back in 1915. He was a successful merchant who migrated to Chiang Mai and settled around Wing Ping, or known as the Chiang Mai Night Bazaar today and the area around his house became an important community hub for all Chinese Muslim merchants that followed. Ban Ha Mosque was later built by Chinese Muslim migrants around Kun Chuang Liang Lu Giet's house to be used as a religious ground and gathering site, and it quickly grew along with the surging Muslim community in Chiang Mai. This prompted him to proceed with a reconstruction and renovation of the mosque to better fit the growing population. The mosque has been reconstructed several times throughout its many years to get to the magnificent building that we see today. In the close vicinity of the mosque are famous halal restaurants, such as Sophia Chiang Mai or Kosai Islam, which sells Chiang Mai's delicious local dishes all day and is always packed with locals and tourists coming in for a meal. The famous Kun Shuang Liang Lu Giet's original wooden house is well preserved by the locals and was made into a site for Gat Ban Ha, or Ban Ha Market, located just across the street from the Ban Ha Mosque. This Friday market sells a variety of goods, such as vegetables, street food, and herbs and spices from both the Islamic and Chinese communities around the area. And on the topic of markets, Bololot Market, or Gatluang, is the biggest market in Chiang Mai and also the oldest with over a hundred years of history. This market is packed with local food and souvenirs. Being very popular among tourists, this is where everyone comes to shop for local food and products to bring home. tourism in Chiang Mai, we can't leave out Taphad Gate, the city wall of the old kingdom of Lana, which once acted as a fortress for the old city. Based on the real wall in the past, it has been rebuilt in parts over the years to carry on the rich heritage of Chiang Mai and serves as a memorial for Lana's historical wall. After that, we venture to Chiang Mai's most famous temples and landmarks, known for its unique beauty and design, such as Wat Jie Di Luang, we can see the old historic structure that is still standing with its distinct design from the old Lana era, inspired by the art of Pala of India. Apart from all the historical sites to see, while exploring the city, you will notice Chiang Mai's unique vibe of art both contemporary and traditional Lana style are integrated and rooted into the lifestyle of the local people. The city is filled with cafes, extraordinary coffee shops, and monuments. Even the famous walking streets of Chiang Mai are filled with art, including portraits, drawings, posters, handcrafted products, and much more. It is a scenery that will easily leave its mark on you. So if you are someone who is looking for a city with a relaxing atmosphere and great weather among mountains, waterfalls, and a rich art scene and unique culture, Chiang Mai, by all means, is a must-visit place for you. 